So it is currently 7.50 and Linden has never slept this long. So I kind of don't know what to do with myself. She kind of like squeaks in her sleep, so I can't sleep because every little squeak, I am up. Are you okay? Are you ready to eat? Is it time to get up? Are you hungry? I don't, <laughs> this is the longest I've slept. I don't know what to do with myself. But right now I'm just going to wash some pump parts so that I'm ready to pump on one side while she eats on the other whenever she's ready. Hi, Smiley. Let's get you changed. I'm gonna read some more Alice. Chapter six. When suddenly a footman in livery came running out of the wood. Is this an all done baby? You ready for some burpins? Do you see yourself? That an all done baby. Nice big girl. You look right at mommy, huh? Big smiles from the happy baby. I love you so much. Who's being the absolute cutest baby? <gasps> you are. Are you just being the absolute cutest, Lyndon? Hi, beautiful. Oh, hi. Oh, no. Do you get the hiccups? I think it's good that she's getting into the routine of taking her long rest and then eating as much as she wants when she gets up. You my hungry hungry hippo. Hungry hungry hippo. Um, nom 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 nom. Lots of nice snuggles. And now she just finished eating. I'm so full, mommy. Big stretch, mommy. I'm gonna go ahead and probably make a smoothie. She really likes looking out windows. So I'm probably going to set the Mama Roo up in front of a window so she can peek out the window. My smoothies have become quite extravagant. It's like nine ingredients. You can hear Lyndon's hiccups and squeakers in the background. You okay, Lyndon? So I put half of a banana, a whole banana is just too much. Frozen pineapple chunks, mango chunks, and strawberry chunks. Organic probiotic yogurt, pineapple juice, orange juice, good belly probiotic, 2 billion, 20 billion probiotics per serving, apparently. And then just for some extra protein, I put in just the slightest little bit of this PB Fit. Say no more, mama. I got done. I want hugs, please. Mwah. If you have a tropical smoothie near you, it kind of tastes like the sunrise sunset tropical smoothie. She loves looking out the window. You're just looking at the window, huh? Lyndon is not quite old enough for a full session of tummy time yet, but she does like laying on her mat and... <laughs> Don't you? Don't you, sweet girl? And she will play with this little caterpillar as she's doing now. <laughs> she also has this rattle toy that we put on her feet and her feet kind of make the rattle sounds. Yeah, you're demonstrating amazing. 
occasionally we do roll her over onto her tummy just to get her used to it. Ooh, ah, ah. Are you talking to it? We also have this little um, book that has a lot of uh, high contrast images that she can look at. Please. You need a diaper change, huh? Let's go get your diaper change. So after her diaper change, she got super, super fussy and uh, we bounced on the ball for a little bit and that usually calms her down and we were bouncing and bouncing and bouncing and then she got fussy again at that point it was noon so we went in to wake dad up less than a minute later dad hands her back to me and says oh she's hungry she's definitely my hungry hungry hippo so Devin's family is visiting this week and today is their last day. They fly home today. We're still feeding her when they arrived. She was just bouncing around with grandma, got a little massage, got some gassies out. I just wanted to brush my hair, brush my teeth, and put on some real clothes, but she was hungry again. I love, love, love that she slept for five hours last night at three weeks old. That's amazing, but I think I'm paying for it in the cluster feeding today. It is now 1.20 and I finally have a chance to take care of myself a little bit. It's rough sometimes depending on how long your baby eats and how much baby is cluster feeding. I did mention earlier that I was pumping on one side and as she was eating on the other. I have a pretty bad abrasion on my one side. I've talked to a lactation consultant and for 24 hours, I'm gonna try just pumping on one side. I am going to be sharing my whole breastfeeding journey because I did so much research before I started breastfeeding. I was so excited to start. I was excited for the whole journey of it. And then I realized it is freaking hard. And what I thought I knew was little to nothing. We'll be doing a whole video on my breastfeeding journey. So Devin's family just left. She is still not sleeping. It's been about two and a half hours that she's been awake and she really only should be awake for no longer than an hour. We've noticed she's been pretty gassy and we've been using these tinctures, infant tummy relief, and they do help her, but they're only short term. She needs a nap. I need to pump on this side because she's eaten twice on this side, nothing on this side. So it is now past two o'clock and she is still not sleeping. The only little naps that she got when she eats, she does sometimes soothe on me. Now I'm just gonna rock her on the rocking chair and read her Alice in Wonderland. Hope that she dozes off and gets some good sleep. Bouncing on the ball with dad finally got her to go to sleep. So I'm gonna do a quick refresh of the kitchen and our room with having visitors over. Things get kind of hectic and we don't really get to spruce it up as often. So I'm just gonna go and clean everything up that we've gotten behind on. So it's four o'clock and the baby just got up. Can you say hi? Can you say hi? Lindy. Say hi. Oh. Who's my hungry, hungry hippo? You're my hungry, hungry hippo. Who's mama's little girl? You are. You are nearly going to attack me. Was that yummy? Was that a yummy meal? <laughs> Lincoln, do you love your daddy? So we just came in from our walk. She is out. She might be just waking up. Oh. Oh. And back out again. That just put her right to sleep. Oh. Good night, baby. Good night. So around 7 p.m. we woke Lyndon up. Daddy gave her a diaper change and I gave her a feeding. Now she's getting some burpins. Huh? 
we do try to implement a little bit of a routine because dad's going to be going back to work soon and we're definitely going to benefit from having a routine. We did start introducing a bottle to her just to get her used to it so she doesn't refuse it later. Huh, little girl? He likes being able to help out and feed her as well. And oh, she, she just flipped me off. How rude. How rude. Did we even show your cute little outfit? I don't think we did. <gasps> Mommy's little girl. Mommy's little girl. Mm. Why do you look like such a big baby on the camera? You look like such a big baby. See, I'm not a big baby. I'm three weeks old and I only weigh eight pounds. Why you look so big? Ooh. Dad, I will not listen to this music. Oh, yeah. Babe, I don't think she likes the music. Yeah. Yeah, no, she's throwing a fit. I think we should play country music instead. Or some good Christian, you know, Hillsong worship. Even in postpartum, if you are breastfeeding especially, that you should still be taking your prenatals. And I added this whole mega fish oil that um, my friend recommended. This girl took um, about two ounces of her bottle, but she still has two ounces in there and it's good for another two hours. So we'll probably um, give that to her in like an hour and a half. But we're just watching a show and... <laughs> and winding down for the night with our girl. It's 10.15 and she finished her whole four ounce bottle. Oh. I'm just gonna snuggle with her and let her sleep as much as she wants. And then I'll feed her on both sides. Um, not sure when that will be, um, but then I'll feed her on both sides and hopefully get a long stretch after her big feed. just finished eating on both sides now I'm gonna swaddle her and put her down for the night so because she slept for five hours last night in case she sleeps for another five um, I did go ahead and pump um, after she ate just to make sure it was all drained so that I don't get any type of engorgement that could lead to infections that are dangerous that was a full 24 hours of a newborn. I know it might seem like I did not get much sleep or um, maybe, I don't know, maybe it seemed like I got a lot of sleep because that was her longest. Your body completely adapts to it. It affected me like maybe the first three nights, but after that, I was just kind of used to it. You get to hang out with your baby in the middle of the night. Like who doesn't want baby snuggles? I mean, it's great. So 